What's good sneakerheads, crep junkies, crep aficionados, it's your boy Haniel, aka Heavy Kicks and we've got a special one for you today. The good folks over at Forcefield NYC have flown your guy out to New York to come and check out the sights and sounds of SneakerCon NYC. And if you look over my shoulder, it's not just your average sneaker event, it's a damn carnival out here. There's so many kicks, there's so many stalls, there's so many events going on. You've got a crazy trading pit way at the back. It's madness, but also I'm gonna have some of my sneaker familiar from New York come and show you and help you get to know what's going down here at SneakerCon. Let's go. Hey, what's going on? I'm out here at SneakerCon NYC. It's your boy, Def the Foams. And Elle told me to real quick just show you guys what we, what we got going on out here. Bleacher Report is actually out here at SneakerCon 2016. Bleacher Report is one of the places that they actually make fun of athletes. And that's something like a TMZ. They're like the TMZ of athletes. I'm just happy that they are because they might have a guest speaker. They might have somebody that might be spooked. But this is what I was talking about. They have the Yeezys out here. A colorway that hasn't even dropped. They got a couple other colorways. They got, of course, the LeBrons. I mean, it's been crazy. But as as you can see, Bleacher Report is here, live and direct from SneakerCon 2016. It's your boy Depth of Holmes. Catch you later. Managed to catch up with a lovely friend, Mr. Kampa, aka Mikey Dabs. How you doing, my brother? What's been your highlights here today at SneakerCon? I like seeing the kids. I like seeing the kids that are new to the culture, getting here, making deals, getting a little crazy, grinding it out in the trading pit. I think it's, I think it's a good look, and it's nice to see them getting along and not fighting, which I like even more. But I, that's my favorite part: is the kids. And I, I see the bags are looking a bit light. Did you buy anything today? That's a negative. I bought a lot of stuff before I got here. Air Force One's dropped today, Black Toes dropped today, so I and most of the stuff that's here I have, so yeah. That's why they call him the camp out. My brother, thank Thanks you for, very much, man. Thanks for having me. Cool. You you're watching Crep Junkie TV? Are we doing that today? <laughs> People, this is BZ on behalf of the Shoe Side Squad for Crep Junkie TV. Now, right now, I am reporting live at the madness known as the SneakerCon Trading Pit. There's sneaker shows all around the world, and everyone's a little different. SneakerCon is infamous for the trading pit, and one of the reasons why is because people trade, they buy, they sell. You know, almost like a, a flea market, a swap meet. Now, the reason why they implemented this is because they don't want people blocking the, the aisles, which they still do, because, you know, people bring duffel bags. But this right here, I mean, the entrepreneurship is from all ages. You see little kids, you see old people, you see all genders, males, females, all races. It's a beautiful thing to see the sneaker hustle in the community. There's only 15 minutes left and it shows no sign of slowing up. It's been a crazy day. We've seen kicks upon kicks. We've seen sneakerheads from the US sneaker community. It's been a mad. I also want to pick up Death the Foams, uh, Suicide Squad, and Mikey Dabs, who helped show you guys, you know, some of the things that go on at SneakerCon. And guys, I'm tired. I'm gonna go and get something to eat right now. And until next time, it's your boy Heavy Kicks. Peace.